Hi, welcome back to Storytime at my house. Today's book is Homer the Library Cat. So I thought it would be a good time to introduce you to one of my cats. This is Blue. He is one of the barn cats here at our farm and he catches a lot of mice. He's a great hunter. Now Homer in the library, he doesn't catch a lot of mice, but he sure does love the library. And Blue would love the library too if he was allowed to go, but we're not allowed to take our pets to the library. This book is written by Reeve Lindberg and illustrated by Ann Wilsdorf. I hope you like it. Homer the Library Cat. Homer was a quiet cat a mouse. A quiet lady lived with him in a quiet house. The lady went away each day. Homer stayed at home. He sat beside the window, peaceful all alone. He played with yarn and feathers. They made no noise at all. When he heard a bird, he purred. Mice played with his ball. Homer was at home alone the day he heard a crash. He jumped right out the window and landed in the trash. The trash cans fell and banged and rolled and Homer ran away. Where was the quiet lady? What a noisy day! The post office was right next door. Homer went inside. But Hope and Noah had to sneeze, and Homer had to hide. Inside the fire station, he found a quiet place. Right beneath the ladder, a cozy cat-sized space. Clang, clang, the fire bell rang. A fire, a fire in town! Five fit firemen jumped right in. One quick cat jumped down. Homer ran and ran and ran down to the railroad track. He found an empty box car and jumped up in the back. A locomotive came along with engineer and crew. Just as Homer fell asleep, the whistle blew Choo-choo! Homer ran back into town and through an open door into a quiet building across a quiet floor. He heard a quiet voice he knew. He saw a rocking chair. There was the quiet lady and children everywhere. Homer, said the lady, what are you doing here? Homer jumped into her arms and purred into her ear. The boys and girls loved Homer. Homer loved them back. He slept right through the stories, but woke up for a snack. Now Homer is a library cat. He goes there every day. What do the children think of that? It's perfect, they all say. The end.